Come on, have some cake. You disappeared too? Oh, yeah, I had to make a couple of calls for work. Oh, see, I thought I may have scared you off. Why would I be scared? I don't know. I didn't know how you'd react. First time I told you I love you. You're gonna let me go fall in love with you. Ow. What do you think? Goofball? Uh, why don't you tell me? Well, I'm flattered. And, um, and I'm a little overwhelmed. And, um, and I'm usually relieved. Because, as luck would have it, I am, I'm in love with you, too. that you weren't looking for me. <laughs> yeah, you got something in your eye. It's, um, I have new makeup on and it's just... Yeah, let me, let me get it out for you. It's, it's not, um, it's not even really bothering me anymore, actually. I mean, I'm happy for Maxie and Spinelli. <laughs> it's interesting, right? I mean, someone really close to you falls in love, and, and no matter how great a couple they are, you still feel like the one who's left out. Yeah, well, Maxie is, without a doubt, the most vain, the most selfish, the most messed up person that I know, and somehow she still manages to find the real thing. <laughs> Maybe she's not as messed up as you think she is. Well, I love Maxie like a sister, so that's why I can be a bitch about it. <laughs> I'm sure she feels the same way about you. I mean, I'm not interested in Spinelli for anything other than a wonderful friend. I just... I just wonder if I'll ever have what they have. No. You'll have what you have. I mean, I can't speak from experience, having never been in love myself, but I have it on good authority that uh, love lasts until you're old and gray. And it shows up when you least expect it. Call in a couple of favors and it's on its way. Fifteen minutes, tops. Ladies and gentlemen, okay, uh, keeping in with the tradition, the non-bride and the non-groom will now throw the garter and the bouquet. So can we please start with the gentlemen, all of the single men, line up. Come on. Come on. Wow, really? Okay. Help Spinelli, the Swiss Come on. Come on, best man, you owe it to Spinelli. Get out there. Oh, thanks, I'll pass. What? with the gods are playing for you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now it's time for the bouquet toss. All the single ladies, line up. Excuse me. Can I require your presence? I wasn't even invited to the wedding. Well, you're still I'm just here. here to pick up the girls. You're single. Come here. Stand right there. Okay. Don't look. Sir. <laughs> no, 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 no. You didn't want to do it. I don't want to. I don't want to go anywhere. You want to see what that got me? Yeah. No thanks. <laughs> oh, so are we gonna fight each other for the bouquet? 
<laughs> we did a Terry and Brucey's wedding. Yes, except we canceled each other out, and Melanie Freddie mm -hmm. caught it instead. Mm -hmm. Melanie's still married. He's got four kids, so yes, she must oh, have done something right. Hail the power of the bouquet. <laughs> This is a horrible little tradition. Why are we doing this? Because we're single and we're fabulous. We have good taste and high standards. Let's stay here. Okay, are you ready. ladies ready? Yes. Right. One, two, three. Oh! Nice! <laughs> Behold, stone cold and fair Samantha, evidence that the stars are perfectly aligned. <laughs> Do you mind if I take him first? Oh, again? sure. Good okay. Okay. <laughs> You're enjoying yourself. Never been better. Is it because Spinelli and I didn't get married? I just want you to be happy. I am happy. I have someone very special who loves me. That is rare. I wasn't talking about Spinelli. I was talking about you. You've loved me my whole life, and I feel really lucky for that. I'm the lucky one. So do you think now that, you know, Spinelli's done the noble thing and we didn't get married, you could maybe start to like him? If that's what you want. I knew you would do it. You're an eminently great man. Eminently? See, Spinelli's been quite a good influence on me. <laughs> I love you, Max. I love you too, Max. Hey, what's up? Oh, thank goodness you're here. I need your help. For what? Robin, she, she's up to something. You call me. Okay, uh, ladies and gentlemen, friends and family, we're now bringing you the portion of the evening that involves karaoke! <laughs> Yeah, I would be delighted to sing to my Maxi on Tonight of All Nights. Oh, you're so sweet. But actually, tonight, all of us are going to sing to you. Mm -hmm. yeah, come on! Oh, no. Come on! Oh, it's okay. It's karaoke. All right. Come on. You heard the girl. You gotta sing. <laughs> okay, everyone, gather around. Come on. Come on in. Okay. All right. Hit it, Coleman. 